You, you just got finished uh, sparring Jaron Ennis. Um, what, what was that like? It was a real great experience. Uh, not too long ago, I sparred with Terrence, with Bud, mm. and it was a great experience as well. I'm so happy I'm getting experience with these guys and for his top level and Bud's top level. Uh, it, it's just great experience. So this, both, they both have different skills. Uh, uh, Boots, he's great, great fighter. He knows his time is very well. He hits hard. So he knows what he's doing. So for me, going with him is a great experience. All right, now, what, what are some of the things that he did well? What were some of the things that you could capitalize on? His body work. His body work and his timing is extremely well. Um, there's some body shots that he threw in there that was – I was like – even though I was like, dang, okay, that was pretty good. Yeah. But he, his timing and, and he is hard. Like, I don't know why, but on TV, sometimes when you see him, it's like, oh, his punches don't look like they're – but they do hurt. He, he is he's a hard – he is hard. Mm -hmm. um, he's a skillful fighter. All respect to him, and I'm glad he gave me the opportunity to go into the ring with him. But uh, also for me, it shows me that I can hang with these guys in the big league. So that was going to be my next question: sparring at Terrence Crawford, sparring at Jerron Ennis. Those mm -hmm. guys are boots is the IBF interim, so he'll be the next IBF champion. Mm -hmm. Does it let you know, like, okay, like if I add a couple more things or I get some more experience, I will be, I will be there. Yeah. I will be in the conversation. I, I'm telling you, give me two years, and I'm going to be there. Two years, and I'm going to be there. On the, uh, I'm going to win one of those belts. Um, uh, like I said, this, me working with these guys is a great experience for me for the, coming to these fights like July 15th. I know it's going to be a stoppage and I know I'm going to win this fight. And I know what I'm capable of. My team believes in me and I believe in my team. So working with these guys is just unbelievable. So it's a great experience for me. And they're helping me out. And in some ways, uh, I'm helping them out as well. Um, a lot of people compare them. A lot of people say, you know, Boots style mirrors Crawfords at times. Mm -hmm. Some people say, you know, not so much. Um, do they do some of the things, some of the similar things well? Because I know they're both switch hitters. Yeah, uh, I'll say both of their body work. They both got really good body work. Mm -hmm. um, that That's something I would say that they work pretty well. I think styles-wise, like boxing-wise and stuff, they're different. I think but has more, uh, a little bit more advantage of switching it up and knowing how he uh, adjusts this. Not saying that Ennis doesn't, mm -hmm. uh, but I think uh, Bud, he adjusts a little bit better. better. But they both, something that they both have in common is both that body work that's extremely good, I'll say. Okay. Um.